here's the thing too. Like, I don't want to use staircases to get to level 100. Because I want to use those to get to like 300. Now the thing is, I could do both at the same time. But then I'm afraid that like, I'll get so excited putting the staircases down that I'll forget and actually go past 100 while I'm doing it. Which I don't think actually would happen, but I don't know, though. Oh, we have so much crap. I mean, at least we didn't lose anything because we didn't die. So, there's that. Potato seeds in there. Oak resin in there. Stone also in there. Check the mail here. Show to team member, 1,000, yeah, whatever. I'm fine. That's, that's okay. Can we enjoy the gifts I sent you? Well, goodbye. Thanks, Emily. Thanks for the sea urchin. There it goes. <laughs> I will tell her I enjoyed it very much. Alright, let's make more, baby. Oh, yeah. Yeah, we found like four iridium bars in the mines. I stuck them in here. But, I'm gonna go ahead and sell them. And now it's time to do the animals, the most pointless. Increasingly feeling that way thing. Okay, that's done. Um, we didn't check the spirits today. They're not gonna be very happy three days in a row, I can tell you that. Yeah, just neutral. Neutral's okay too, though. I mean, it's still no reason not to do it. Stick this in here. That's an Iridium Star, so I'm going to sell the Silver Star one. Just because. Alright then, well. That begs the question then. Of what do we do? I missed the Wizard's birthday. It was on the last day of the festival, but... Today's Evelyn's, but I already have her ten hearts, so it kind of doesn't matter. It doesn't matter if you're my best friend, it doesn't mean I have to remember your birthday. Arf! That dog barks so much, doesn't he? I guess if you don't, you know, pay attention to him, he probably barks more. Which would make sense, really. Uh, I guess I'm doing this again. I feel like it's become kind of the same thing over and over again now, hasn't it? Well, it is winter, though, that's the thing, you know, it's like... Ah! I guess we could bring the Mega Bonds. Where else are we ever going to use them? Uh, as far as food goes, we can bring the Life Elixir. We can bring the Crab Cakes. Crab Cakes will be our food, like our survival food. I think that'll work out pretty nicely here. All right, the more I do of this, I feel like the less I'm actually going to show of it, which may lead to me having another three-day video here. Oh, but that last excursion was just so exciting, though. No, I don't want to do that. I want to hold these two worm spots right next to each other here. Okay, here we go. Man, that boob has just been there forever now, hasn't it? I keep forgetting to bring sweet peas. Sorry about that, Miss Sandy. That was a rhyme. Unintentionally. Okay, so neutral spirits would probably just go a little bit easier here today. Of course, watch this be the one where we get it. I can't believe that I was there. Like, I made it. That is rarely enough you can get down that far. And then when you do, you wind up finding a hole. God, if we hadn't had to cut it so close with the time, I could have looked around a little more for a staircase. Maybe that's what I should have done. I just don't feel like I ever would have found it. I thought maybe if I jumped in the hole, it would just automatically trigger the cutscene because I passed 100. I don't know, because sometimes they do that, you know, like... I'm trying to think of an example of that in a game. Where, like, if you take a warp zone or something, it still stops you because this has to happen between here and there. There's gotta be an example of that in a game somewhere. Kind of fun to try to think of things like that. Dude, there's a hole right here. Holy crap. Seven levels. Oh, we couldn't have had holes this good before. 
now that I think about it, when I was back on floor 95 and I said something like, all we need is a really good hole, if you found a really good hole, you could skip 100 from that too. Perfect. Well, that could not have shown up at a better time. Oh, man. Okay. Ooh, nice. Oh, yeah, it's coming in, and there's a hole right there. There's no better sight. Uh, isn't that... Whatever. It's probably the best way we could have done that, really. <laughs> There's another one. Okay, let's look at our situation here. We're gonna need to replenish that thing pretty soon. Whoa! Oh, I was trying to eat the spicy eel, not take the ladder. This is careful, you idiot! I said across her nose, not up it. Oh man, there's a oh. hole there. Oh, if I start rejecting holes, the computer's gonna think I don't like them, and it's gonna stop giving them to me. I don't know, you ever wonder if that's... that's not true. Obviously it's not, but still. Holy shit, holy shit, holy shit. Wow, let that one come a little closer, didn't I? Oof. My fingers started like banging on the keyboard in panic. Aha! Ooh, okay, seven levels. Let's hang in there. We're doing just about as good. We're doing just about as good today as we were yesterday. Well, are we? 61. We were at 72, 750, right? So I remember thinking, like, the tens digit of the floor was the same as the hour. So we're four floors behind where we were at this time yesterday. It's not horrible, to be honest. I'm surprised I even got past 50 at all. I mean, especially on a neutral day? I don't know, dude. They keep running into floors like this that just refuse to budge. Oh, there we go. Okay, now, let's do it. We have better holes today than we did yesterday. I think that's what's definitely helping. I haven't been using as many bombs either, I don't know if that... I mean, I don't see why that would affect anything, but... No. Alright, put one there. Oh, there is something there, jeez. Let's check and see if it made a hole over here. I mean, you kind of think it would. Blowing a bomb usually makes holes. fast that time. Look at all the gold on here. Holy jeez. I basically got in the habit now of like every single time I see a hole, just check my health before I jump in. It's probably a good thing. Ooh, look at this. Look at all this bombable mess. Tell you what. Nice, nice. I think we have a shot here. 85, 1040. Oh my god. Dude, we're gonna get it today. I think we are. I'm using the bombs now. It's full force at this point. Hell, I might even slow down and pick up some iridium while I'm at it. Let's get our supplies here. I don't know. I don't know for sure we're gonna get it today. This is gonna be risky though because, man. Oh, there it is. Okay. 94. If you're gonna give me the hole, give it to me now, because if I see it on 97 or 98 or 99, I'd be like, nope. I'm gonna have to. 
and I have to be like, nope. Okay, 95. Oh, a hole is pretty risky now, too, though, isn't it? Get out of the way, seriously. I know, it's after midnight, but it is 96. We weren't this far at midnight before, were we? I think we were still like in the early 90s. At midnight before. Okay, there's one. There's one. It's 12.20, 12.20. Don't even mess with me right now. 99. Okay. Okay, good. Alright. I don't know why I'm hitting this Iridium. This is not a good idea. This is not smart baseball. Please, dude. Please don't do this to me now. It's the worst possible time you could be doing this. And if you drop a hole, I swear. Out of here, please. Thank you. Shit, they're all spread apart, so like it's not really any good to use a bomb. Just, oh my god. Okay, maybe right here. Uh oh, uh oh, uh oh. Wait. You've got to be kidding me. I can't believe it. I just couldn't turn around in time and... Wow. I, if I walked past a hole or something in there... Well, if I had walked past a hole, I would have been smart to because I was looking for a staircase. I mean, I covered that entire floor. What are... Mm, I don't want to say what are the odds. I don't want to play that card, but still, man. Well, all that just happened in like 10 minutes right there. Are we getting hauled back to the doctor or whatever? Yep. Jeez, I'm not even going to get home in time. I'm just going to pass out on the way. Boy, oh boy. I don't even know what to say to that. I'm, oh, wow, look at that. I was one step away. Jeez, I have to get, I have to get hauled in by the doctor, hauled in by Joja. I mean, at least we made some decent money here. Holy crap, dude. Wow, I can't believe that. I can't believe two days in a row that I got that close and just completely botched it. I mean, I didn't botch it. Shit, the staircase just wouldn't show up. But, you know, <laughs> okay, fine. Yeah, you know, we could have done a few things differently there, but well, what, I mean, that was a neutral day on top of everything else. Okay, so I'm recording this like a week and a half later. So hopefully the, uh, the, uh, Transition is not too awkward here. I have a cactus I haven't been watering. <laughs> Someone mentioned that to me. I think maybe I should do something about that. Um, wow. <laughs> I got too many errands to run here. Um, well, let's just see what we don't need here. Oh, we do want that. Oh, uh, you know, I guess we don't need that or that. All oh, that coconut, though. There was somebody who like, had a side quest for a coconut. Last night a JoJo team member, oh yeah, because I died last time, good lord, because I died on the toilet. Anyway, alright, let's grab some more iridium here. I could have just kept it on me earlier, I guess, but I didn't do that because, oh well. Oh, we always need to miss one of them furnaces there, though, don't we? Well, just gotta keep the money rolling in, that's all we can do. Alright. Let's go over here and take care of our... Well, you know what? Here, wait, let me check this now, because I want to know if I need to be hurrying here. Are we going to have another super happy day here? No, oh, they're somewhat annoyed today. Well, it's probably for the best, because it's probably getting a little repetitive, me sitting there going in the mines over and over again. And not even taking the best approach. Like, what I should be doing is going in there with stone. You know, already in hand, so that that way when I run into one of those floors... That's like all monsters, then I can just 
Yeah, like I said, bring the staircase with me so when I get to those floors, I can just skip them right away. That wasn't really well. I did do that on the last trip, but, eh, well, you know. Yeah, so I just got offline from uh, Delta.com. I decided to go ahead and book my trips, book tickets for Atlanta. Because I was going to drive it, I'm telling you, I was up up until like five minutes ago, that was the plan, but I decided, no, I just don't know. It's just, it's right on the borderline of where it's too long, you know? Just ten hours, which probably by the time you add up all the stops for gas and everything, probably add up to more like twelve hours. Plus, I've seen the way traffic is down there, and <laughs> let me tell you, not exactly... I'm not exactly anxious to get back to it. Hell, I remember when I lived there how the traffic was. Like, you couldn't... You just, like, you can't get away from it. I, I don't know if maybe the population is more dense down there or something, but... I tell you, every time I go there, I just, I'm so glad I'm not driving because there's so many freaking cars. There's more cars than there are people, I can tell you that. Sometimes I wish I could just, honest to God, sit down and just do an, a real experiment to see. Because I just don't buy it. I, I, I never will. But hey, alright, what are we doing? What are we actually doing today? We're not going to the mines today, Pam, so you can rest assured. You're okay. Um, oh man, I had a dream last night that I was down to eight hearts with Penny and she wasn't my girlfriend anymore. And I was like, oh, it broke my heart. I was like, oh. I could ride to the desert just to give the sweet pea to the sand. You know, maybe I'll, maybe I'll do that. I don't do that often enough. Well, I mean, I'd ride to the desert plenty, sure. But, uh, I don't think I didn't see those worms there. What you got for me? Helps if you click inside the window, you know. Just a thought, just a thought. There's another one right there. Yeah, I can't believe I walked past that oak resin <laughs> last time. I think I walked past it like two or three times. So, sweet pea delivery, here we go. Oh, sometimes I just can't stretch it out. It's fine. Yeah. Alright, seriously. I'll be yawning. Of course, I did wake up kind of early today. Earlier than I usually wake up. I don't know, man. Hi there. Boy, do I have a surprise for you. Hello, I absolutely love getting flowers. So happy. You better believe it. Hey, I don't know if it's anybody's birthday today. Wait, worms in the desert? Really? Have we ever seen that? I'm sure we have. I just don't remember. Well, back to Stardew Valley. I always imagine, like, somebody coming in and, like, randomly coming up in the coming in on the video, seeing this one part where I say back to Stardew Valley and being like, oh, that's what Stardew Valley is, but still not knowing because they don't know the context or something because they just happen to come in on that part or something. I know that doesn't make any sense, but oh well. That's life for you. Life doesn't make sense either. So Harvey, gotta tell you, man. That is such a nice gift. Yes, it is. You're such an asshole. No. Okay, alright. Alright, who else we got here? What kind of quest are we looking at? You still want that red snapper, huh? Well, I don't have a snapper. I got a fiddlehead risotto for you. Evelyn, I missed your birthday. It doesn't really matter, though, because I'm Janet Jackson. So, oh, there's Kent over there. What's he doing in here? Holy crap. Oh, I guess it is Sunday. Oh, he's going to worship service. Okay. Yeah, dear lord, please forgive me for all the people I killed, and you know, please forgive me for this fiddlehead risotto that I'm about to eat, because it's probably got animals in it, and mom used to give me this when I was a young boy. Yeah, I see George in there, too. <laughs> I don't know what George would be saying. Something like, oh, hey, uh, <laughs> Guess I'll be meeting you real soon, but, uh, anyway. Well, uh, thank you for the leaks and for making them and everything, making them grow. 
giving them sunshine to grow on. I'm just doing nothing here today. Okay, so yeah, here, here's a duck feather for you. Yeah, I know, it is beautiful, isn't it? I could stick around and hoe this up, I suppose. I haven't been over here in a while. Yeah, it's just stuff built up over here. That's the thing, though. I don't think it really builds up. It's not like the fruit cave, you know, where if you leave it alone, stuff just sits in there. It's like, you know, you have to get and go and pick it up every day or else it just goes away. I don't really have my fishing pole on me or else I'd take a dip in the waters up here. I don't think I've actually fished in the mountains yet in winter. Robin, Demetrius, Sebi! <laughs> Sorry if anybody finds that annoying. I don't know, it just seems like a really weird name to call somebody, though. Here's a frozen tear for you, man. How did I know? Oh, that's a long story, Sebastian. Sebastian. <laughs> it's like that stupid time that I was talking on a tape or said something about Daniel La Russo. And I pronounce it like La Russo. Like, what? I don't know, man. I don't know why I think about such stupid things sometimes. I guess since we got the shortcut back to the farm here, we can run back and grab our fish and pole. Okay, so maybe maybe I can keep this in a treasure chest closer by. So that it wouldn't be that much of a... Oh, nope. No, I'm okay. I don't need to talk. Whoa! Oh, I didn't mean to do that. Oh no, did I kill my cactus? I think I just killed my cactus, you guys. Oh man. Do I have a coffee bean around here? What if I do or not? If I did, it would be in the seeds chest, because I do. Well, there we go. Okay, uh... How about that? We will be using it again pretty soon here. With spring coming around. Of course, that is assuming that we go into spring. I don't really know. Boom. boom. Gotta make Grandpa proud. Make as much money as we possibly can here. And this last week we got here, man. I can't believe it's down to one week. And we're basically done. Oh, I put my watering can away. I was gonna go water the dog. Not that there's any reason to, but oh well. Yeah, you, you gotta be thirsty. There you go, bud. Have at it. Drink it up before it freezes. Yeah, I guess that thing with Evelyn earlier where I was worried about the chocolate cake. I had these flowers here I could have given her. Tulips. Plenty of those if I wanted to do that. If I wanted to do that, that is. Okay, so I seem to be unable to locate my fishing pole here. I wish there was a way you could just, like, type something in and search for it. Wow, it's nighttime already. It's over here. Here we go. Oh, you know what? You know what I never do? I never light up my fireplace. Here. Keep it warm in here. Let's make it funky. I'm not sure where I got this iron ore from. I'm like dropping that off there. So I guess we'll just ride up to the mountains and throw a couple lines out, see what happens. There's really no reason to. Excuse me. Um, a horse is bigger than a dog. Please. Oh, don't stop there. Don't stop there. Okay, I'll go the other way. Maybe he wants me to go the other way. Maybe it's like in the movies where the dog misdirects the person and then because of them getting misdirected they bump into some girl and they end up falling in love. You know, one of those things. It's funny because I call it a trope yet I probably couldn't name one example of it. I can think of like, I think there's a Disney movie somewhere where a dog runs around a couple so that his leash gets wrapped around their legs and forces them together. What is that? Is that like Lady and the Tramp or something? I'm trying to think of where I've seen that before. Well, I guess I don't have my, uh... Oh shoot, I should have made my Dish of the Sea. Or made one. Because I had one on me before, but I ate it. So... 
That is still a big bar, though. Oh, you know what else I never knew? I learned this from Argon Matrix. If you just hold the mouse button down, it stays at the top. I didn't know you could do that. I always figured it would just bounce off the top and come back down, but I guess not. Oh, well. We got perch, we got coal. No, don't throw any of that away. Those are both good. Mostly done here. Oh, look at that. Right when I go over there, they disappear. They always disappear, man. I always catch them on the tail end of their schedule, whatever it is. I almost wonder if it would be quicker or more time effective to just, like, walk around and look for them. Uh-oh, uh-oh. What do we got? What do we got? What do we got? Stop! That was, oh, I'm telling you, man. I think some of those, like, are, are, are nearly impossible unless you know the pattern in advance. Speaking of energy, I'm actually using up my energy today, which is kind of surprising. Well, then again, we're coming off of a day here where I not only died, but then didn't make it home from the doctor before 2 a.m., so... Well, it's definitely gonna wake up with very little energy today. Oh, here goes another one. Nope. Oh, get down there, get down there. Okay, stay, 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 sizzle. You'll be sizzling when you, uh, get in my fry pan. I make too many illusions to that, don't I? How do you expect a fish to stay on your line when you keep talking about the fry pan? What are you, Paula? Stop doing that. Hold still. I'm gonna get you. I'm gonna get you. I'm gonna get you. Oh, God. Oh, oh God. We're gonna set a record for longest fish session here. Please, 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 please. Oh, yes. Okay, okay. Well, there's your link cod. My horse is over there staring at me like, oh my god, when is he gonna leave? Why am I standing here by this tree? He never even gave me the stupid hat. Let me just look at my side quests here. <laughs> Bring Goss a coconut. Bring Maypal syrup to the secret woods. Oh. Maybe I should do that. Bring Willy a lingcod. <laughs> well, I just caught one. I'm gonna reach 100 in the Skull Cavern, which we've been trying to do. Bring Gus a lobster. Man, I got a lot of stuff for Gus in here. Maybe we should work on that tomorrow. Well, this has already been kind of a weird video, because the second half of it was recorded so much later than the first half. But next time, it should be all one day's worth of... You know, like, it'll all be recorded in one sitting, unlike this one was. In we go. To Betty Bye. Alright, what do we got on farming here? Oh, just the animal stuff? Alright. A lot of little assorted goodies here. Void Essence, battery pack. Oh, those battery packs. They're good, man. And obviously, iridium bars. Oh, 36,000. It's just so good. 